Pinky Pride. Okay, another Pinky Pie episode. Great. Great. I don't know, for some reason that character, like, in that picture just looks very strange. It's like a completely different uh, design than all the other characters. Like, the, the shape of the animal. It's also got a shirt. It looks kind of weird. I don't know. When I hear, like, Pride, I just think of Gay Pride. It's, like, the first, like, thing that comes to mind, but I doubt this is what this sh would be about. Yeah, I, I'm... I'm <laughs> These episodes are just really boring. I, I feel like it's just going to be really boring until, I don't know. See, like, because it's like, I, was, I think I've mentioned this comment like a million times, but this comment said that the end of season four is is, is where it's good, apparently. <laughs> they were defending the show, and they were saying that it's good at the end of season four, which of course is a terrible defense, because that implies that you gotta watch like a hundred episodes, and the last two are good, which is a horrible defense, but whatever. So that means that if I get to that that point then the episodes should be good i don't know but until then i still like i gotta slog through what like 14 more episodes or well i guess 12 more after this one. Oh, i'm just so out of things to say okay we got some party going on his name is his name is cheese sandwich okay then is that milo murphy i mean well he's played by weird owl yankovic is that his name oh i know he did that like bunch of music parodies like canadian idiot and then for some reason now he's doing voice acting i have no idea why okay there's the balloons because Pinkie Pie does party stuff. Oh no, no, stop singing. <sighs> okay then. This is so obnoxiously upbeat. This is just pain. Yay, it's over. Yeah. Okay, there's an attempt at a joke. She was in front of the poster. Oh, I don't fucking know. Oh, there's the cupcake in the eye. Okay then. I want to fucking die. Oh yeah, I completely forgot this guy from the cold open. Name's Cheese Sandwich. What the fuck? So is this like the male version of Pinkie Pie? But he's really serious. Oh my gosh, shut up with the stupid... Ugh. Oh no. Okay, that's definitely Weird Al Yankovic. I hate this so much. At least this is like visually interesting. This is kind of like just some just batshit crazy animation. What, so she's going to be jealous of him now? Okay, she's sad because she's being replaced. Why doesn't she just work with him though? I guess that's gonna be the lesson. Oh no, she's jealous. Okay, she's sad. Okay, that's awkward, I guess. Oh no, sad. Is this just gonna be like a shitload of her just being sad? Is this gonna be another song? <sighs> This does just make me think of generic, obnoxious, like, Disney songs. Well, I guess this is kind of, like, about what's the meaning of life. <laughs> or, like, it's like she's questioning, uh, she's questioning what sh she is or why she does things. I don't know. Ugh. I don't know, I'm still just really bored. Like, the song with the, the cheese guy, him singing, with, like, it wasn't his singing that was interesting, but all the ridiculous animations. There was, like, a bunch of creativity there. This is so tame with, like, what they're doing. Like, and just... I don't even fucking know. Uh, so I guess she's gonna do a bunch of dumb antics instead of, you know, just talking to the other people. <sighs> and then that's gonna be the lesson, that she just has to talk. I really think if I was watching this, like, if I watched this episode first, I'd probably hate this just as much as if I watched the actual first episode first. Okay, just a rule book joke. Because Twilight has the million books. I feel like this is meant to be really tense or something. And then it's just like, into this just ridiculous shit. But it's just not. This is so goddamn dumb. What the- <laughs> Okay. This is going to this random, like- I don't even know what that- Was that just- Whatever. It was some weird different thing. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> they just put a straight up clip of a lizard just- They just recorded a lizard, like, in a forest or something. What? Like, that's the kind of thing you do when you're, like, editing a YouTube video. What? the fuck? I guess she's speaking Spanish? What the hell? Okay, there she goes. She's ending the competition because you don't solve things like this with dumb competitions. But now she's realizing... Oh, whatever. Boo-hoo. Sad sadness. Oh my god, I don't care at all. <sighs> the amount of pee all alliteration. I don't... Uh, whatever. Oh look, he never meant to take your place. And there's another lie. Or song. What the fuck did I- <sighs> Another song. Okay, he's really shy. And he's inspired by Pinkie Pie, I guess. Uh, of course it was. Whatever. Oh my gosh, shut <laughs> up. 
<laughs> what is this, the sixth song? This show is basically a musical. I mean, really, it is kind of just a musical at this point, with the occasional, like, plot point about something. It's with this audio mixing. Their voices are, like, suddenly way more quiet. It's, like, drowned out by the drums and that... Whatever. I guess this singing isn't as obnoxious as some of the others. <sighs> Oh, and now he goes to another place. And there's the diary. Oh, is this gonna be another important thingy? Yep, there's the little shining thingy. So every other episode's had the little, the little, like, rainbow shine on something. <sighs> and there's this weird shit for the end. Yep, I just saw the credits. Weird Al Yankovic was the, the, the cheese guy. I guess this wasn't as painful as I thought it would be. Then again, my expectations were so, so low. I mean, really. Ugh. Like, I was fully expecting to just, like, actually be bashing my head into my wall in pain. Uh, okay, so... Plot. It's Rainbow's birthday and Pinky's throwing her birthday party. But then this, like, random guy called Cheese Sandwich comes out of nowhere. He just, like, visits Ponyville, I guess. And then, uh... And then he's like, oh, look at me. I, I throw good parties, too. And then... Pinky gets jealous and thinks that he's is the only one that can throw parties now. So uh, she's all sad, and then she's like, "Oh no, I gotta take back this my my title." And then she goes and uh, challenges him to a goof off, see who's sillier or whatever. And then she realizes that she was just being dumb and petty, and that both she and Cheese can work together to make a good party. And then it's revealed that Cheese was really shy as a kid until he found Pinky Pie throwing some ridiculous party, and then that's what inspired him to become a party. Pfft. <sighs> pony. There was like one song sequence in this. Well, one one particular one. There was like six fucking songs in this. Like, what the fuck? So many songs. All of them terrible. But there was this one that was like kind of ridiculous. It just had so many weird visuals and things. So it's like, there's there's something, I guess. There was like some weird serious moments. Like where Pinkie Pie just got sad. There's this really weird, <laughs> this really weird moment in one of the songs where Pinkie talks about her pet lizard, whatever it is. And then they show like a, like a real like thing of a real lizard it's like they went to a forest or whatever and like recorded a lizard or they probably they probably just used stock footage that was weird <laughs> just wait what i mean really just boring though like <laughs> it's just more boring shit like i don't know this this no i still feel like this story could have been told in 11 minutes you just condense it down cut out some of the songs or make them shorter but like i don't know, i really don't i really feel like you don't need a 20 minute episode for this and this kind of simplistic concept it's just like when you have this spread out over 20 minutes it just becomes really grating and boring i think most like gumball episodes or adventure time episodes if you stretched those into 20 minutes they would be terrible because it just wouldn't it's, they're such simple concepts it wouldn't be able to carry itself for 20 minutes and this show is the same thing i mean there's some of these that work as 20 minute concepts like the uh the one with the games where it was about rainbow's loyalty like that i don't really think you could have effectively told that story in 11 minutes for example but yeah just really boring I give this three out of ten i'd give it a two but there was like a couple points where i kind of laughed a little bit so yeah just really fucking boring <sighs>